Facebook is changing on April the 30th, 2015. What's happening on April the 30th? Well, a few things. Facebook has been trying for quite a long time to find a balance between open data and protecting users. One thing they are concerned about is allowing other software applications to access Facebook's data. And this is called an API or Pro Application Programming Interface. Many of these applications will be locked out after April the 30th. Of course, Facebook will keep becoming more restrictive and most users likely won't mind or see a lot of the changes that are taking place. However, if you've ever used an application that accesses Facebook data, like, for example, importing your friends into a calendar, then this will cease working after April the 30th. Let's have a look at what else will stop working after this date. What won't work after April 30th are things like apps that alert you to your friends' birthdays, anniversaries and key events, as well as apps that help you manage your contact list, and any social recommendation apps, like apps that recommend music, restaurants, travel, websites, universities, based on your friends' activities and interests. Similarly, any genealogy, family tree type apps will be restricted, as well as apps that let you print off your friends' photos as gifts for them. Other things that will stop working are dating apps that use your social graft, as well as any apps that allow a different view of your Facebook feed. Also restricted after this date are geographic friend-related apps, like apps that show you when your friends are nearby now or have been to a certain place, as well as apps that rely on social stats or summaries of, of, of profiles of your friends. And lastly, any apps that help you to search across your social graph or for specific messages, places, photos, etc. As we discussed, this only applies to application programming interface and not to the actual Facebook service at facebook.com. So if you do live on Facebook, you won't see any difference after April the 30th. It is only for certain applications. So for example, if I want to add my friends to a calendar, what can I do? Well, the new Facebook is API is generally restrictive and they might as well close it down forever but they're not doing it quite yet. The new Facebook API will not allow you to do that whatever that is that you're worried about after April the 30th 2015 and there's no real reason to hope for any changes that involve Facebook being more open in the future. Facebook keeps forcing users to spend more time with the official Facebook and click more ads and there's nothing that we can really do about it. So services like accessing your social graph in a pretty picture will certainly be restricted on this day. What we're concerned about and can't quite confirm are other services, especially the Yahoo service that allows you to import your names and email addresses from your Facebook friends list. Our take is that this will be restricted after April 30th so you can not, no longer use Yahoo Mail or a similar service to import or indeed export your friends data out of Facebook, uh, especially things like their name, their email addresses. It is clear that you will be able to access your friends' names after April the 30th using an API, just not anything else like birthdays, photos, or email addresses. Our advice is, before the April 30th date, if you do rely on or would like to use a service like Yahoo Mail to access your friends' email addresses, make sure you do this in the next couple of days so you have a export of this data before the April 30th deadline.